So what happens after PewDiePie hits 100 million subscribers? He's scheduled to hit 100 million subs in about a month at his current growth rate, but he'll probably not be the first to reach this goal. So sad. But the question is, what will PewDiePie do after 100 million subscribers? Will he just crawl back into his closet forever and retire? Well, let's find out. Welcome to my channel, my name is Premium Mayfid and I post videos like this every Saturday. So make sure you go down and hit the bell icon and go ahead and leave a like on this video to help grow my small channel. Before we get into this video, I have a magic trick for all the desktop users out there. Basically, I'll make your video progress bar turn into a rainbow color if you follow my simple instructions. Just type the word awesome on your keyboard while watching this video and boom, you're welcome. So you're worried about what will happen to our PewDiePie after he hits 100 million subscribers. People have rumored that PewDiePie will stop creating YouTube videos after he hits 100 million subs. And the fact that his fiance Marzia has already quit YouTube doesn't make things much better for us PewDiePie fans. So before we actually answer this question, we should look at some of the background info on Felix. PewDiePie started YouTube about 8 years ago and he is still uploading to this day. Everyone talks about PewDiePie now, but did you know that just over a year ago his channel became nearly stagnant? Yet despite losing his popularity, PewDiePie kept uploading, which is important to remember as we go through this video. He kinda lost his hype and was not talked about near as much, until this PewDiePie vs T-Series topic became viral. This relit the flame for PewDiePie and helped him grow faster than ever, but something that is scary to think about is how many YouTubers who started around the same time as PewDiePie have suffered from burnout, resulting in them retiring from YouTube or just quitting. This even makes me wonder if PewDiePie is getting tired of creating videos. He's created thousands of videos and he works on videos nearly every day. And Felix has had to put up with criticism from basically every journalist ever and he's also had to put up with YouTube who demonetizes his videos. But could all this cause PewDiePie to actually quit YouTube? Well before we answer that, let's look at one more reason why he may retire. So another thing to think about is that Felix will be getting married soon and it is possible that after he gets married that he may want to concentrate on other things like his family and friends like his fiance has already done. So before you freak out, all those are just possibilities and reasons why he may retire and despite all of that, I highly doubt he'll actually quit YouTube anytime soon. The main reason I say this is because he does not care about numbers and if you watch his videos from like a year ago, you can tell he still enjoyed making videos despite his channel kind of slowing down on the growth rate and becoming nearly stagnant. I think that after PewDiePie hits 100 million subscribers that he'll lose a lot of hype and the T-Series vs PewDiePie meme will go away, but I do not think that PewDiePie will let this stop him from entertaining his army of 9 year olds. He seems actually a fun recording videos and he even has editors to make his job easier and I think that he has taken a lot of steps to make sure that he won't burn out anytime soon. So what happens after 100 million subscribers? Basically PewDiePie will just be left with his true fans after all the hype of the memes goes away, but is that actually that bad? Anyways, if you enjoyed this video make sure you hit that like button until it turns blue. Also subscribe and turn on notifications if you want to see next week's video. Peace.